Hello Aquarius, welcome, I'm Ryan, thank you for being here. This is going to be a general reading, so of course everything may not resonate. Take what does and leave the rest. And for more tarot readings after this, please check out my wife's channel, Route 53 Tarot, to read for you as well. Thank you. You're funny, Aquarius. <laughs> You're funny. I haven't seen that one either. I do appreciate it. Really? Is that so? Whoa. Interesting card trick. Wow, what an energy. What an energy. Um, Couple more, or two more, and I'll jump into this. There's that two wanting to jump out. All right, jumping into this. Right away, what you're showing me, Aquarius, there's definitely, it, it's interesting. I, I kind of feel like you are not only learning about yourself, um, you're, you're learning about everything about yourself. It's not just like, oh, like, who am I? It's like, no, it's, it's for some reason, it's like everything. It, it was self-study. Um, I like this energy. I like this energy. Self-study. Um... It's a nice energy. It really is. I feel like you are learning about yourself and, and oh, geez, whatever's going on. Um, I feel like it goes hand in hand with something you may be dealing with or maybe someone specific. I'm not too sure exactly. You're, be, you're being very nonspecific, but you are going through some major changes. It seems and it feels like you you know you have to you could be even questioning what you believe what you believe maybe your your faith your spirituality your religion you know what you look up to what you don't look up to that sort of thing um and you're trying to come up with something and you actually do now what's very interesting about this is whatever this idea is that you come up with it seems like if, at first, you know, at first thought or first sense, it feels like intuitively like this could be it. This could be something. But then the longer you kind of sit with yourself and process things, you're having the realization of like, mm, it just doesn't feel right. Something just doesn't feel right. And, and it's very quickly you are leaning into this and kind of accepting things and like, well, it is what it is. Um, and this overall energy of like, it is what it is. You, you're having the realization of like, there are there's some problems and issues that need to be taken care of, whether it be romantically or whether it be financially. I don't know. It could be a little bit of both, honestly. Um, you're, you're, how do I say this? 
you're showing me this energy Aquarius of walking away energetically speaking. In reality, it's kind of like you walk, you're showing me that you're walking away. But it almost kind of seems and it feels like you're leaving a piece of yourself behind. And even though you try to walk away from whatever the situation or circumstances are, it's kind of like... It's like you, it's like, it's almost kind of like you tell you, how dare you? How dare you for abandoning you, Aquarius? What is this? It's almost kind of like, are you, are you having the realization or the wake up call or the experience of like, um, leaving oneself behind? It's kind of like, you know, it brings me back to the, you know, the childhood stories where it's like, you know, children or kids had to grow up so early or early on. And it's like, I didn't have time, time to be a kid. I didn't have time to, you know, enjoy my childhood, that sort of thing. Um, and it's like, now here you are living an adult life with adult, adult responsibilities and doing adult things. And it's kind of like, you can't just abandon the little you Aquarius anymore, because guess what? That little you is going to like tug on you and be like, Hey, that's kind of like what you're doing to yourself. You're choosing to put yourself in a situation or position that it's kind of like you are energetically already know um, it ain't it. It's too problematic, whether it be emotional or financial, both, both and all of the above. It's too problematic. And you have that realization of like, you're just slouching in place and having that realization with yourself, like of this, um, your heart just cracks on the inside. Your heart just cracks. And it's almost kind of like you're doing it to yourself. It's kind of like if a vampire knew that they were a vampire and they got tired of being a vampire in their vampire ways. And all of a sudden they're kind of like, well, I'm looking at the steak. So, you know, it, it's like, don't know, don't know. And you don't know where things are headed. You don't know where things are going. And it, it seems and it feels like, um, well, if I just keep on moving, if I just keep on moving, if I just keep on moving... Um, I'm getting like adrenaline energy here. I just had coffee this morning. I understand it. If I just keep moving, if I don't slow down, everything will be all right. Can't stop, won't stop, don't stop. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, keep the energy moving. Um, but like I said, right here energetically, it feels like you left a part of yourself behind. And that part's kind of like, you know, tugging at your heartstrings like, hey, don't forget you, Aquarius. Don't forget you. You show me initially, it's kind of like you staying, yeah, you, you show me that staying on the move is enjoyable for you. But then after a while, it's kind of like on the move, on the move, on the move, on the road again. I just can't wait to get on the road again. What happens when the road doesn't bring peace of mind? Nice, nice. Country roads take me. Is that song, Country Roads. Yeah. Take me home to the place I belong. Country roads take me back to the place I belong. Um, home is where the heart is, Aquarius. Home is where the heart is. Once, once again, even though you kind of show me like um, this, this unfortunate, painful awakening that you're that you're going through, even though you are still staying on the move. Um, I feel like it's definitely with a different energy. That's for sure. You've, you've seen some shit. You've been through some shit. It's painful. Life is, you know, the hard knocks. Um, but you're, you're excited to make changes for yourself. And I, and I feel like what's going on is you're, you're finding deeper parts of yourself. You are. And that feels really nice because it's almost kind of like, you know what? Um, you're, it's, a learning, it's a learning experience. Life is a learning experience. You'll, you'll find out who you are and you'll find out who you're not. And that's the most important 
priceless lessons you can have in life and experience. So um, it's kind of like, well, take a minute and allow your life to flash before your eyes so that you can gain a little bit of perspective as to kind of like, wow, let me look at the entire whole picture and figure out, you know what, now where do I feel like going? Or what do I feel like doing? So there's something here that you are working on that I do see, you know, there's a lot of love there. So we'll see where this goes. Um, but of course, if you are dealing with anyone, you could be dealing with a fire sign, an air sign, an earth sign, or a water sign. Goodbye.